is there a difference between property trust, family trust, shared trust, business trust? Legally speaking, there isn't such thing. Most people define these trusts mainly because of what they're going to do with those particular trusts. Let me give you an example. I might be a property investor and say, I want a specific trust be the one owning shares or for that matter, directly owning properties. Therefore, I'll call it Shilly Boy Property Trust, right? That's typically what you will find people doing that. And then another person will say, this particular uh, trust is for all the share ownership of various companies that I'm involved in. Therefore, I'll call this particular trust Shilly Boy Shares Trust. So that you find. And then other people have got a concept of family trust where they know that Everything that is more family close, let's say primary residence, uh, let's say uh, uh, family cars, uh, holiday homes, I'm putting them in this, or for that matter, cash belonging to families, certain unit trust, investment, like endowment policies, life policies, payouts, goes into that family uh, uh, bank. You can call it a family bank of some sort. Um, I'm just borrowing uh, the, the, the terminology there. Um, so then people would then typically then call that a family trust. Is it, does it really exist, the meaning or the terminology, does it really exist in, 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 in legal form? No, it doesn't. It's just a way of people distinguishing this trust so that it makes it easy for them to clarify what is that for. Okay, good luck.